Hello everyone. In today's session, we are going to see how we can create loyalty points in Mac CRP software. For that, we need to go to Master, Promotion, Loyalty Membership Card, Card Master. And here we can create the card name. For example, I am giving it as Gold Membership. And here you have to enter the sales value above how much sales value should the points or discount should start getting calculated. For example, I am giving it as 1000. Next is the discount type. We have three types which is one is of points, one is of discount percentage. Here you can enter the discount rate that is 2 percent, 3 percent. And then next is the discount amount. How much discount amount you want to give that is 100 rupees, 200 rupees. So next is about points. So we have two types. One is of card based and one is of mobile based. So first we are going to see about card based. So uh, here you have to mention the cost of one point. For example, uh, my total bill value is 2000 and my cost of one point is 100. Then the total points earned on that bill is 20. Similarly, I am giving it as 100 here. And uh, how many minimum of points they can redeem? 100. And discount value of one point that means one point is how much rupees? So I am giving it as 1. Next, if you want to generate your cards automatic or manual, if just click on manual and enter the how many cards you want. And then you can enter the card number. Next, if you click on auto, here you have to enter the number of cards, prefix, suffix, and from uh, which number it, sh it should start and the length. And then click on generate. So here you can see the card number has been generated and then we can save. And next we are going to see about is mobile number base. So I can create one more card. For example, I have it as platinum membership and above how much sales value. So I have it as uh, 1500 and I will tick on use mobile number as card number. And similarly, I'll enter the cost of one point, minimum point they can redeem, and cost of one point. And then we can save. So next is we are going to see how it's affected on the bill. So we'll go to sales, we pause, and enter a bill here. Enter the mobile number, customer's name, and then we can save. And next we are going to see if we go to masters, Promotion, card issue. You can even issue the card manually by clicking on the card name. Here you have to enter the customer's name. And if you have any expiry dates for the card, you can just enter that and then you can see. Now again, if you go to Masters, Promotion, Loyalty Membership Card, and Card Report. And if you click on just Show Issued Only and then click on Show, we can just see uh, what and all cards have been issued and to whom and their details and then if we go to masters promotion loyalty membership card and click on points update we can manually update the points for each and every customer enter the customer's name here you can see their current points and if you want to add or subtract their points even you can do that if i am subtracting their points i will just keep it on minus and then we have to enter our remarks here and then you can just see. Uh, let's say if the customer is redeeming the points, enter their bill, enter the customer's mobile number and the customer's name. And you can see their total points there and their balances as well. So if they are redeeming, you have, here you have to click on points and enter how much points they are redeeming. And then we can just click on proceed and in the points discount we can see how much rupees has been discounted for them and then we can just save. And if we click on print, the customers can see in the print their opening points, their points earned on this bill and the points they have used or redeemed and next is their closing points. If we go to Master's Promotion, Loyalty Membership Card and Points Report and click on Show, 
so here you can see the customer's name and what type of card has been issued to them and how much points they have redeemed and how much points they have so if you even double click on that we will get in a detailed summary and next if you go to file data import and click on opening points so we can even import our opening points and then we can click on download template and we can even give the template name and then click on save and if we click on yes the excel sheet gets open here you have to give the account name which card and then card number and their points for updating that we need to close click on upload file click that excel uh, all the information will be scrolled down here and then we need to click on import this is how you can import previous points of the customers as well so this is it for this today's session thank you everyone